Trying to figure out what you're doing. And that's her. But she hasn't come out yet. See, kiddo, this is your bed. And you can't get to it from here. You've got to come out to go in there. So, 11 days before due date, we're starting to nag. Okay, let's go. Anything to say? Yeah, thanks for filming my graceful exit from the car. Not bad. Huh? Are you filming my stomach? I got you too. Well, tell her what day it is. It says what day it is. Tell her anyway. Ten days before she's scheduled to be here. Yeah. It's a Wednesday afternoon. About 2.30 in the afternoon. It's 1.30. Whatever. <laughs> Pretty face, huh? What, mine or hers? You Yours. That's so gorgeous. My physique is what makes me perfect. Well, if we go like this, you can't tell you're pregnant. Huh? So if we go like this, you can't tell you're pregnant. I like the juice get me from here up or something? No, I got you from right about here up. Okay. Good job. Alright, what do you say? sitting in another doctor and saying, okay, epidural. You know, while I'm trying to, in between paths, say no. not what I want. Hello. How are you? Good. I have allergies. Uh, oh no. I told Kyle I said I'm gonna break my water sneezing. I just know. <laughs> <laughs> you get away from me with that camera on the scale. Nope. Why are you doing that? It's her last. It's her last visit. <laughs> We're gonna follow her into the bathroom and everything. <laughs> have a party. Want to get up close and personal? We should have done the uh, the pelvic this week. Yeah, she is gonna do it this week. Oh, she did last week. <laughs> did she? Yeah. You feeling fine? Everything's okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So she. Because your porn shot. Yep. It just occurred to me today that I might want to think about pre registering. Oh, gee, that might be a thought.
birthday from oh, ours today. Just a random. It says too late after the month. Oh, bummer. <laughs> <laughs> Did you want to drink more glucola? No. Uh, I want to buy a bottle of that Nastola for, for whatever pig stole my Diet Pepsi out of the refrigerator. Uh oh. <laughs> Steal this. <laughs> Carrying a big load. Yeah. Sorry. Okay, there you go, man. Thank you. Have a nice day. You too. This is the hospital. That's well. That's you. And this is maybe your last appointment card in the world. Maybe. Maybe. We hope. the hospital that you're being going to be born in. But right now, I need to eat, so your dad's going to have to give up the camera. 
See ya. She's all bunched up right here. That usually means she's going to kick the heck out of me over here. your chicken up. This camera shy does not come out. Who am I so to please? She's kicking because she knows you're there. Let me see your hand. Feel her? She knows you're there. Oh, that's a that's squisher. Feel her? She's moving around. She's trying to say hello to you. But she can't talk? No, she's not out of my tummy. When do you think she's going to come out of my tummy? I don't Three. Three. Three days? Yeah, three days. Maybe. This day. You think five days? The doctor says six days. Tell she should be here for sure. Six days like this? Like this. No, I like this. That's not six. You want your new sister to come? Yeah. What are you going to tell her when she does? I love you. And let you give her a kiss goodnight. Say happy Sunday night, sister. Happy Sunday night, sister. We'll see you in six days. We'll see you in six days. I want to see you tummy. No, not tonight. I just want to see sister. I can't see your eyes. I know you can't see your eyes, sweetheart. You can't see your eyes because she's not on my tummy yet. It's time for baby sisters to be in bed. It's time for baby sisters to be in bed. Big 
brothers too. She's kicking because she knows you're there. Can you feel that? She knows her big brother's talking to her. My hand is way right down here. Mm -hmm. And these are her legs. Mm -hmm. And this is her hair. Mm -hmm. But this is a waist. I don't have a waist right now, boo. Waists are around belly buttons, and my belly button is right there. I got a waist right here. Yes, you do. Pretty fashionable waist, I might say, too. Well, we better tell sister goodnight. Uh, goodnight, sister. Wow! You have anything you want to say to sister, Dad? Huh? Whoa, I tripped over. Daddy's real funny behind the camera, but when he's in front of me, he clams up. Come on, Alex. I'm falling. I want one piece of candy. One, one half a brownie. Say goodnight, sister. And I want one half a brownie. My sister can look like that. <laughs> My sister. My sister. Well, tell, tell your sister on the camera where we are. Where are we? Let's go. At school. What day is it? Is it Wednesday? No. Are you sure? Tuesday. Wednesday. Wednesday. You're not even going to look at this, Alex? Well, where's your class at? What about I? Hey! Alex. My dog is scratching my My dog is scratching my hair. Your dog? Yeah. Yeah. Your dog is scratching my That's the last I do. <laughs> I put that down there. It's like the light at the end of the tunnel. My sugar fest begins on that day. Right. <laughs> you're going to not care for it. When, when you're I know. Ready for I know. I tried to get off the wagon and have a peppermint freeze the other day, and it made me throw up. I was like, well, this wasn't a good plan. Didn't keep it down anyway, so. Okay, your sugars are doing fine. So, is the baby deciding to come out or is just stay? Mm -hmm. to stay She's just there? hanging out. Hanging out. 93 on the hemoglobin, huh? Oh, cool. That's, That's less than last time. Um, glucose random is 93, not the uh, hemoglobin. That's the uh, random glucose. I haven't any bones last time. No ankle bones at okay. all for like two months. This time you're back and done so good. Yeah, I wish somebody would have talked to me about diet last time instead of letting me blow up 65 pounds. <gasps> well, now you know, so for the next day you can do all these steps. No more. <laughs> we'll have a match set. Yeah. That's it. That's it. Sure. Did so well. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> and 
I mean, I'm not sure enough to do anything definite yet, but. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, we don't want to do anything that we do the day he's like these two years ago. And I jumped up, and jumped up to, to say, this is all the family that I'm going to have. Wait till the babies, you share with the babies that they do well, health wise, and, and you know how the intelligence is going to be. Uh, if you decide to have one more, should we do it? We should do it and then say, oh, I wish we had one more. This baby is probably going to be very easy for you to raise. Just for the kind of fact that you kept it really well controlled inside the uterus. Yeah, second one, it's so, so much easier to raise. Really? Yeah. So they're much more active, though, but they're not easy to raise. Really? Mm -hmm. I, it just occurred to me the other day, I guess last night, I went, oh my gosh. I just, it occurred to me the midnight feedings and all that stuff, and I went, oh, am I ready for that again? <laughs> you know, two years of diapers and... How old is your son? Um, he's three and a half. Oh, it's a beautiful age gap. That's really? The child is going to enjoy it. He's going to really love his baby sister. Sister. Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> yeah. so she comes here, we call her by her name. Ah, uh, that's mm. cute. So Diamond came in and she said, now what if she wants to do pelvic? What if she wants to induce? And I told her to whisper. Well, Taylor, it's time. It is Wednesday, the 28th. And it's about 6.30 in the morning. And this is what it looks like outside right now when you're uh, giving your mom contractions of about mm, five minutes apart or so. We are definitely ready for you to be here. Really, really looking forward to this. Oh, oh pretty nice looking out, huh? Beautiful morning. This is the house that you're going to come home to. Right here. Car, you're gonna pull me in. Well, we'll talk to you in a little bit. Hey. Like the winners, I think, are stupid. Mm -hmm. I guess maybe the funniest one I ever saw was the guy going over the fence backwards after the ball and ripped his pants.
probably about 10 minutes old right now. This is erythromycin. Okay.
about me. She's, what do you think? Oh, she's great. Yeah. She is. Oh. You like your legs? Good. There's a switch there. You can give a kiss. I still remember the first day we had one.
I wonder if Shannon delivered. Dr. Knopfler had to deliver patients. Labor yesterday. about time to come home. This is the hospital you were born in. This is what it all looks like. Parking lot. And the other side. Right up there is where you were born. We spent the last two days. There she is. Even saw the air fresh. You want to open the other door so I can put her in the first hand? Yep. Here we are, about three weeks later. It's her first ride in the swing. Well, you don't seem to mind too much. But you're not completely happy with it, but you're content. Taking that binky now for about oh, a week and a half now, I'm getting better about it every day. You still eat 20 times a day, but you get not too bad about that. Let's see, that is who doesn't know she's being filmed right now. Beautiful mom. October 25th. It's a Tuesday. Actually, you're just about a month old. You're about four days from a month old. Getting so strong, you can lift your head up now. All kinds of stuff. I'll look at my chin a little bit. 
Bye. Bye. I can tell you're not completely happy, so Let's see if I can't make you happy. We'll talk to you in a little bit. I love you. Well, this is the way you sleep most of the time. Right, Mom? Let's see. It's Thursday. And you're just one month old, and this is your mom with the new hair. New. New color. It's got a little teeny tiny bit of red in it. Kyle, quit. Go film your daughter. Kyle, go film your daughter. I will. Bye, Mom. Here you are. Crying and complaining. You're hungry. Taylor. Well, say goodbye. Okay. Got your little uh, pacifier. And all is right in your world. See? You're one month old today. One month in a few hours, anyways. Love you. See you later. Playboy Centerfold. No, you're second. You're second. First one out of the womb. Just likes that. Yes, yeah, she does. She's going to be a water baby. It's nice. I need to get all the dirty dishes in the background and everything. Of course. So I can do like this and just get her. She's got her face right now. See, you enjoyed baths from the day you were born. She's going to be like her mother. She's going to be the type of person that likes to have a bath to relax every night, just like mom. Yeah, just like your mama.
Yeah, so huh? I'm trying to keep this R rated. She just gets so jittery and she jumps all around. Uh huh. Go film what her brother's doing right now. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. She's looking right at us. Look at daddy. Oh, hi, Mom. Hi. Hi, these are fun. These are fun. Don't like it when you get hiccups, but you like your gas. Oh, yeah. Those are pretty cool. Those are pretty cool. See you later. Say bye, Dad. Say bye. Bye. Yeah. Ma. Ma. You got something to say to your sister? I kiss you. She's taking a bath right now too, you know. Sitting? No, in, in the kitchen. Hi. You got to say anything? To your sister? I love your sister. Now I'll take care of you. You call me a cook. You need me, I will cook. Anything else? Valley, Monday on the Fox 26, 10 o'clock news. It's all in order. The beautiful eye sculpture, lots of fresh flowers. Pat Branson, catering director at the Lamplighter Inn, has been planning everything from weddings to conventions for more than a decade. When you call Pat, you can be assured that she will personally guide you through your entire event and that every detail will be planned with taste and class. That's the Lamplighter guarantee, and that's Pat.